Hey, good afternoon team. Real quick uh, video here, instructional. Uh, we're going to start with the login of system. You're going to have your system password. If you don't have it, you'll have to get it from your OVP, uh, operating partner, whoever it is that has that data, your franchise specific. You're going to log in. You're going to go over here to maintenance. You're going to go to cash management. You're going to select a cash category. This is how you add a button if there's not already one in. I'm going to start with the caveat of stating that it's my understanding that corporate has added this button system wide. So give me a second here. I'm going to go down and find it here. There is a DoorDash button. There we go. DoorDash, credit card tips. Cash paid in category for corporate. They put it in. Should be in your store in the event that it's not. Down here on the bottom, it says F8 to add. You're going to hit F8. You're going to hit door dash CC tips. You're going to tab. You're going to tab one more time to get to paid in, paid out category. You're going to hit F2. You're going to select cash paid in right there. Cash paid in. You're going to hit enter. You're going to hit F10 and save that. Once you save that, it'll pop up right here on your list. It'll say DoorDash paid in. Whatever we put in there. I have an existing DoorDash button that we've already put in at our store level prior to them putting it in a corporate. But remember, make sure and check and see this button should be here. I-53, DoorDash credit card tips. It is corporate owned, so they push it to all the systems. Once that's done, we go to cashing out a DoorDash driver. When we cash out the DoorDash driver at the end of the shift, it's very important whenever we cash them out, you're going to go to reports. You're going to go to operational. The only thing there will be team member checkout. You're going to select that. I'm going to select a specific date as an example. Last Friday. Last Friday we have two DoorDashers. DoorDasher 2 and DoorDasher 1. I'm going to select DoorDasher 1. I'm going to hit this button. On DoorDasher 1, right here where my arrow is. Not sure if you can see it. Right here is a line that says non-cash tips. On that line, $48.45. You're going to print that so you have that. I recommend printing that for every time that you cash out your door dasher. It's very important that you do this. You print it out, you put it in a book, and you save it. You have your hourly shift leader save it, your assistants, whomever cashes out the door dasher, you save it. Every one of them is dated at the top. Highlight the date, highlight the non cash, highlight the date here, and then highlight the non cash tips line here. Save them in a book. Every morning as the manager, when you come in, you're going to look at this report and you're going to verify it. I'll go over that next. To post the DoorDash money into the store, you're going to go to posting. You're going to go to post cash transactions. You're going to do cash paid in. You're going to select the category of DoorDash right there. You're going to select your DoorDash. You're going to select category for cash repository of store cash. Very important. Cash paid in. Your DoorDash button. Store cash. The description. You're going to do DD1. And you're going to do the date. On this one, it's uh, 122. So notice it's DoorDash1 on 122. You're going to hit the plus button. Remember I told you we're going to highlight those numbers and that's what we're going to highlight them for. $48.45. We're going to put that in. 48.45. We're going to hit done. We're going to verify that all this is again ready. Right. One more time. Cash paid in. DoorDash. Store cash. The date and the DoorDash driver number. The amount. You're going to hit this save button down here. When you hit this save button that's here, it's going to ask for a password and it's going to process once that's processed, if you need to verify that you've posted it, you can check your DOR. In the morning when you come in, if you have them save this page in a book, guys, it's very, very easy. This will make your life simple, I promise. This will guarantee that your money is balanced every day. And if it's not, it eliminates the question of whether or not it's DoorDash cash. Every day when you come into your store, there's an operating report in your printer on that operating report, 
I'm going to select the date on this report that we have in front of us, and that's the 22nd. We're going to pretend that you walked in in the morning and there's a piece of paper in your printer, a stack of papers actually. And in that stack of papers, page one has all your information. And right here at the bottom on page two, it says DoorDash credit card tips. This number here is slightly different because there were two DoorDashers on that day. I only printed one report. So you're going to verify that your number here matches whatever reports or report that you have for the day prior. You need to verify that. If those numbers do not match, that should be a phone call to whomever closed to find out what we did and what we can do to fix it. Sometimes the DoorDash uh, tips don't get posted on the proper day. We have to make sure, guys, it's not hard. It takes five minutes. It really does. It takes five minutes to go in here and just post these. We can verify this. And then on your end, if you don't have this operating report and you want to check, you're going to go over here to financial, cash transaction. You're going to switch this to detail. You're going to switch this to cash paid in. You're going to select a category of DoorDash credit card tips. You're going to leave this, cat, this repository alone. I'm going to change the date to the 22nd. You're going to select whatever dates you need to verify. I recommend doing this daily and weekly. Weekly should be a much more in-depth report. So you're going to print this out. You're going to hit this play button. It's going to show you exactly what you need right here. It's going to show you that we have this report for DoorDash 1, who on the 22nd got paid in $48.45. We're going to verify DoorDash credit card tips, Dasher 1, Right here, 48.45 on the date of January 22nd. It's all about checks and balances, guys. It's not hard to go in here and check this and verify. If you have a cash overage, this is usually where it comes from. If you're doing this as well as your instant tips, you're eliminating the abilities and the possibilities of where money could be. You're eliminating the possibility of where money could walk away to. This is the easiest way to manage it all and, the, and oversee the entire process. Any questions you guys have at all, Mamie, Preston, Dave, Bob, they all know how to reach me. You feel free to call me, feel free to email me, whatever the case is. I'll be more than happy to help any of you through it. Good luck, guys.